Okay, this is our last, latest and greatest Airbnb itty bitty kitchen. Oh, and then this one actually has the cost on it. That's really helpful. There's nothing in there. And then individual beds. This is the bathroom. Oh, and there's a little window. It's actually really spacious. Hmm. It's close to that. I want to see out here. Oh, mamma mia. Et voila. What street is this? Well, this is the one we just came in off of. There's ice cream over there, coconuts there. And a scrunchie on my hand. Oh, look! You can see the Capitol building. Et voila. Gorge. I like that there's a fish tank at the bottom. It's really cute. Steph left me and now I'm in the Revolution Museum. I know this is supposed to be a bad omen, but my name is Sabrina, so it doesn't count to me. This is my Sela. I got a mojito and no food because that's just how it is. I didn't realize how low in the hemisphere I was until the moon was directly above me. I think Steph might already be asleep, so I'm gonna say goodnight before I go to bed. There are three boys playing baseball in the square. It's so cute. Goodnight. So it's like almost 8 a.m. and I'm walking around trying to find water somewhere, wearing my Pretty little thing dress. So gorgeous here in the morning. Okay, we are walking to what are the Hotel Nacional? Yeah, to go to the pool. We made it to the pool. 
Oh. And I'm wearing my new bathing suit and I love it. And the ocean is right there. It's kind of cloudy today, but I think that's gonna be better. So then it's not like direct sunlight the whole time and it still feels so hot even when it's windy and cloudy, so it's for the best. Steph left me to get changed. I see her coming back. That's a nice bathing suit. Okay, it got really hot really fast. I don't know if you can hear me actually. Uh, yeah, this is on the side. And now I can't lay on my bed because it's plastic and it's real warm. So, getting out of the pool. You're going more into the sun, and I'm in the shade. Okay, my phone is at like under the 10%, and I don't know if you can see this because my brightness is down, but my forehead is like tomato red. It's so burned, and I'm so burned here. Like this all just happened in the last, that's nice, like, like 10 minutes that I was laying out in the sun. Yeah, you're really burned. Oh, I was doing so well. There's a marathon. Mom would be so excited. What did she say? That we were gonna get way. She didn't have a lot. Update, I got pooped on. That's all my hand sanitizer. But it was very warm and very black. And I just, I don't, I have no words. <laughs> I got something called Havana Sunshine. Very nice. I look like Rudolph. And you'd think I'm blushing because my neck is so red, but that's, that's all sunburn, baby. Okay, we had a cheese board, but all that's left is the blue cheese and the dates and the figs. Uh, we're thinking about getting some cheesecake. Also, it smells like smoke in here. It does smell like smoke. Because you can smoke in here. She will be laughing. Uh, Sabrina's theme song of her life. No, but I think it's a little too optimistic. The farmer John, just a square farmer John. Tied down because I'm so just I, I think all it is I looked in the mirror and I realized how red I was and I was like I need to go cool on this wow um, I think just might take another stab at taking pictures in like the common room in our Airbnb I don't know what is creating this shadow right now that's not my tan um, yeah, and I'm just gonna sit outside listen to the music from here this is like one of the main streets in Old Havana. Well, like it's off one of the main streets. Oh my god, it's so much more tan than the rest of these. I wonder if when I take my makeup off, this is gonna be red too. I hope so, kind of. Other than that, we go home tomorrow. So we're gonna probably leave here at like 8 a.m. because Steph is flying standby. So we wanna get there as early as possible. So I don't know how much I'm actually gonna vlog. We we'll see. Goodbye. We have a long day of traveling ahead. I didn't put any makeup on because I'm not gonna get home until like 12 a.m. Just because we're leaving early on a taxi, hanging out in the Veradero airport for a while. Oh, it's like almost 8 a.m. here, and then we're gonna go say goodbye to our Airbnb host, get a taxi to Veradero, um, to the airport. It's in the airport for four-ish hours, five hours maybe. Hopefully get home to Toronto and then I have another flight um, at nine to the So I'm not gonna get home until 12.45, something like that. Say good morning to Cuba and Havana. Or I guess Havana and Cuba. 
travel open and the sunburn still gonna look so typical on that flight home we got here at like 9 20 and our flight isn't until 2 40. it's gonna be a long day back in canada okay i've got tim hortons and everything and i'm alone now it's very lonely it's currently 2 a.m. on Monday. <laughs> I look really like something else right now, but I just spent half an hour with my neighbor who thank God was commuting on the flight. She's a pilot. She's like a family friend. She helped me dig my car out because there's just a mountain of snow here. I would have had to like call home and get someone to come pick me up otherwise. So thank God, now I'm heading home. Oh, after all that. So yeah, I have school in the morning now. Great.